Hey love bugs, it's Ross, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed, I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you and if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome and to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family. Just thank you so much for the love and support, you know, you're dropping lines, you're being open with me and you're letting me know you're going towards, you know, big and beautiful things and I send extra love and good luck vibes towards you to make sure you excel on everything that you know you can put your mind to and so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while i have not already what are you waiting for please go ahead and drop drop your finger down on that little button and press subscribe to that bell so you know when your girl's about to upload her next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you just tell me about your impact again and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. If you feel like the video has been very informative to you and you want to go ahead and share it with so and so, please go ahead and do so. And give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. And if you um, thank you so much for stopping by my channel and showing so much love and support y'all I've been doing these like so many times so I keep saying the same thing over and over again so my bad so thank you for stopping by my channel showing love and support and I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and the video the um, meditation music I'm trying to say meditation music that I'm listening to today solar plexus chakra healing activation balance willpower um, intellectually binary beats and I will post that link in the description box below and my video today is about impact, uh, twin flame 101 uh, empaths sorry this is a SOS mission save ourselves yes save ourselves I'm sorry you know there's um, some new people that have came in and asked me Rosalind you know who's gonna save me come save me this and this and that I said I'll let you know real quick fast and hurry I can help you as much as I can you know when you can't find the answers if I know I can I've been through it you know great I can help you do that because especially if I've been through it and I know I made it through it I know you can too so it's just like you know I had a dream last night about my dad which made it really emotional because it was like he came to come save me he was like he grabbed my hands like baby come on let's go I came to save you and I was just like you know I was running with them and automatic reaction you know yes I want to go but I was like, Dad, no, you know. And he was just like, what you mean? No, I came this far. You don't know how far I came to come get you. And I'm just like, I, I love that. And I appreciate you doing that. You know, you have been there for me, you know, more than you could have in the physical world. But I know you've been there for me spiritual, spiritually. But this is something I have to do for my own, especially if you're dealing with a twin flame and you're looking for your twin flame to help you. You know, they can help you along the way, but they can never save you. This is something that you have to heal and be able to do everything on your own. You know, that's the way it's supposed to be done. You know, even though it, it, it's a nice thing that somebody would want to go out their way and help you. But it's like everything you have worked hard for will basically be for nothing. Because you, you know, you didn't learn everything to its full extent that you need to know until that perfect timing when the universe is saying, hey, okay, they're learning, they're ready to go, you know, they're they're learning, they're ready to go to that next level, they're ready to get their blessings, you know, because you're, you're seeing everybody get their blessings around you, which can be annoying as hell, especially when you know you're doing so, it's doing good and you're like, God, I keep trying, but you know, why do I keep seeing all these things happen around me and nothing's happening around me? When is somebody going to save me? And that's your mindset, and that's the reason why you have not got your blessings, because you're waiting for somebody to come save you. There's nobody going to come save you. Like these videos, you know, I'm not trying to save anybody. I'm trying to save you from going through a longer version of going through your own hellish nightmare longer than you have to. I'm going. I'm trying to save myself from going through that long hellish nightmare that I truly don't have to go through. But there's a lot of things that we see on the reason why it's blocking our blessings or holding us back. You know, there's days that, you know, I smoke marijuana. No, I'm good and well. That's blocking my blessings. And it's not like, you know, not like blocking my blessings, but it's just like the fact of what I'm doing to do it. You know, use it as an escape. Use it for something to heal from because 
the things that I'm dealing with is so painful that I, instead of going out and knocking somebody's block off, I'd rather sit up here and smoke weed to keep my ass from out of jail, from doing something stupid, you know. But I have to think about it. It's just the things that I'm, I'm hard on myself more than I need to be. So it's just like when you're going through that SOS, wanting somebody to save you, because like I said, I've got, you know, um, emails and letters and stuff with people asking me, Raza, who can save me? How can I turn this off? Can, and I mean, I love people to death, but I'm telling you, there's nobody's going to save you. There's nobody, there's no kind of way to turn these things off. It's just something that you have to go through. It's something that, you know, you have been running from for years, for months or whatever. You know what you're going through. So it's not about, you know, who's going to come save you. It's about how you're going to get yourself out of this situation. How are you going to come back and save yourself? Redeem yourself. Get that redemption for yourself. Have that be for Vandetta and say, hey, I've got this, you know. Because it's always a good thing when, like, if, it, you know, it's an okay thing if, you, you know, you got this big, nice, beautiful car and somebody bought it for you. But... Is it you know it is a different feeling when you can actually say I bought this car I bought this car for my hard-earned money it doesn't have to be the best car it don't have to be the most brand newest car or what you know the update car whatever but when you're able to do something like that on your own you 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 take more pride into it you take more pride so it's just don't wait for somebody to save you from the predicament that you're in you know the universe will help you and the universe is going to be able to take you out of it but the universe is going to have to see are you doing your part to get up out of this situation when they see that you're doing that you have that that positive mindset you're not thinking about everybody's blessings amongst yourselves you know you're not comparing your life to somebody else's you know you can't compare your life to somebody else because you never know what road they had to go through to get what they have to get and just like if when you get your blessings and it might be better than somebody else's they can't complain and ish on your day because they don't know what hell you had to go through to get it so i hope you were able to resonate with content in my video i hope you were able to have a blessed wild out weekend i hope you were able to turn up but yet be responsible and safe so like and subscribe you can hit that notification bell drop me a line i love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites know you are blessed highly favored truly loved and know there is always somebody out there praying for your better days and i will see you on my next video send you uplift abundance healing vibes loving vibes and good vibes anyway all the way if you truly need them and i'll talk to you in my next video and my post notification shout out is to s harris much love to you fam i will talk to you later stay blessed stay prosperous and i'll see you later peace and be wild